So Apex Legends recently came out with um, some new content, some new purchasable content, uh, like two weeks ago, I want to say. And in that content, there was an Axe skin that total, if you bought everything to get to the Axe skin, it was $170. So when you say Axe skin, are you talking about Axe body spray? No, just like the skin of of, uh, of, uh, an Axe in the game. Oh, you get just um, a hand axe for $170. Yeah, so like the way that this played out, um, <laughs> there was this Iron Crown event that had 24 unique items, okay? And they were $7 each to purchase if you spent real money. You could get them in packs, but you couldn't... You, you, it wasn't always guaranteed that you would get one. But if you did get one of the 24, you couldn't get a copy. So if you got another one, you eventually would collect all 24. Okay, but they were $7 each if you wanted to buy them out, right? Once you have all 24 items, only then could you purchase the Raven's Bite set, which included the axe. But that was like another like 3,500 or 4,000 like Apex points in games, which is like another $30. So altogether, it was like 170 bucks. God, it's so fucking, gross. To get this Raven's Bite stuff. Yeah. Um, it seems like an obscene amount to me. I mean, I know that like these freemium games need to make money, but I mean, I don't know. I don't even know what to ask you. I just say something because I, I I'm like beside myself. Well, didn't they? You can compare this to that whole debacle with Battlefront Two, and they were like, "Well, we don't want a pink <laughs> Darth Vader," you know, because it, you know, with all that crap, and the people were like, "Dude, it would take you like eight hundred or eight thousand or two or three thousand hours in the game to be able to get this, but you can just pay this amount of money." What do you mean a pink Darth it? Vader? I don't know what that means. Just like the color? Yeah. Like people are like, well, we don't want to give you that or, you know, the developers. Oh, okay. But besides the point, go Google search pink Darth Vader. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Debacle. yeah, 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 yeah. I'll get it after the but show. But anyway, after the Pokemon show. Like hundreds or thousands of hours in the game to earn something that you can just buy outright. Like mm-hmm. hundreds or thousands of hours. Mm-hmm. Like it took us three arguments and three days to get us to figure out whether we we're going to get on and play hots again today. You know, like how, who, who has 8,000 hours to get a fucking pink Darth Vader <laughs> skin, you know? No, I mean, I could have watched like the Phantom Menace like 500 times over instead, you know? <laughs> I'm a little confused here. I was reading an article about this, that the community's calling it a paywall event. How is this? A, this isn't a pay. This is just all cosmetic it's- shit, right? Well, I think it's a paywall event because you can't get that item unless you have the rest. Yeah, but it doesn't like affect the game. Yeah, yeah people are just bitching because it costs paywall so much event. money. Yeah, I think. Well, it, because I content, I think, I think it's because content is locked behind that paywall. Like you can't earn, you like could never earn that axe. Right. It's just not right. Awesome. Right. Well, and like for me, I mean, I understand that, like, you know what I mean. Like free games, I have to make money. Blah blah blah. But. You know what I mean? If you had to pay like 10 bucks for it or something, fine. Like 10 bucks, you can live with that. But like fucking 170, that's crazy. And you're an idiot if you pay that much money for it. I just think, yeah. This it is yeah, really I think it's, cool I mean, it's safe though, to man. say. I think it's safe to say. I think if you want, if you, you know what I mean? If you want to have the microtransaction and stuff, at least like make them like a little bit reasonable. Just go back. I on mean, it, that's man. just me. Yeah. Dave, like, have can you, you even call it? <laughs> Yeah. Have you seen the Ravens bite? Have Dave? you seen the Ravens bite? I don't care if the fucking <laughs> Ravens bite has a fucking. Oh, uh, I just, get the fuck out of here. Will it blow me too? At at what point? <laughs> at what at what price does it go from being a microtransaction to just a transaction? Like where where is that line? <laughs> when you lose the guarantee. <laughs> <laughs> like, is it like 150 bucks or what is it? You know? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, when did they? Yeah, when did they come to your house and just beat you over the head <laughs> with the Ravens bite? With model? the Ravens yeah. bite, <laughs> it just makes me think about. Do you watch the summit? Did either of you guys watch the summit? A few, you know, it was like maybe a month or two back when they were talking. They had Epic Games and EA and all them there, and they were talking about this stuff. Did you watch any of that? I had read it's some like articles. The best I didn't. Two hours you'll get. I didn't watch some, it. Oh my god! So there's some of the stuff that they were watching, and then when EA and Epic started to throw each other under the bus about it, mm-hmm. and one was trying to make the other one look better or worse. Oh my god! Their arguments over this, you know, loot box microtransaction stuff is just—it's gold. It's common the best, gold. The best hour and a half I've spent on the internet the past like six months, hands down, it's 
it's from um tft e3 the todd <laughs> howard elon musk interview with jeff oh Keaton. christ it's two superstars two geniuses it's a battle of wits up there and the jokes are flying you gotta see it i love one you gotta take an hour to like... out of your day you sit down and just watch it it's hilarious man when they were t- at the very beginning when they were trying to like talk about how they were friends and stuff you're like yeah uh, yeah what was the uh, yeah i remember the last time i saw you uh, it's the uh, best <laughs> i'm telling you todd's hilarious in it not even i'm not even being like oh, fake God. like he's funny dude like you gotta see it good guy todd Mm-hmm. Sweet little eyes. <laughs> yeah, that's a good video too. Well, but all right, anything hey. with Elon Musk in it, so I would too. I would too. Let's let's wrap the show there. What do you guys think? Is that ain't gonna get a whole lot else out of me before we go on a <laughs> <That's> <laughs> transaction it. slash microtransaction rant? Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Um. Thank you so much for listening. Uh, you know, I always say we re- we really do appreciate it. Honestly, uh, you know, it means a lot to us. Just just seeing the views come in every week and it, it helps us keep going. Um, if you really if you really want to support the show, uh, give us an iTunes review. It really really helps us out. Just lets us know that you like the show. Um, if you do if you do listen on the podcast platforms, check this check this show out on YouTube. We have the live recording um, on the channel. We also have our gameplay videos there as well. But uh, thank you so much, and hopefully uh, we will see you again next week.